What's up, Word Nerds? My name is Kenny. Hope you're all feeling good today. It is Monday, September 30th. In this video, I'll be playing Wordle Connections, the mini crossword, and strands. Uh, another reminder to you guys that I do have a Patreon page. If you would like to support the channel and get access to a lot of extra bonus content, go check it out over on Patreon here. Today being Monday means that I recorded the uh, crossword video. So you guys can check out and watch me uh, try to solve the Monday crossword uh, and see if I can get 100% on it without having to use any hints. That's always the goal for Monday crosswords is to use no hints and solve it 100%. Uh, go, go check it out. See if I do that today. Uh, so, all right, guys. Let's get back over to uh, Wordle here. And uh, let's see if we can see if we can solve today's Wordle and not lose our streak. We uh, got very lucky yesterday in, in not losing. That was yesterday, right? I get my days mixed up here. Uh, I think I, I think I almost, I think it was yesterday that I almost lost my streak. Uh, also, I don't have a word yet. Let me get my word real quick. Random word generator sonar, sonar. Okay, it's a pretty good starting word. Let's see if it helps me out. An O. All right. Um. Let's see. I was thinking about C L O, but clove. There's no N for clone. Um, uh, there's no, okay, F-L-O, hmm, block, let's go with block, B, okay, no, there, there is an L, L-O, C-L-O, was I gonna say clove? No way clove is the answer today. Okay, good. <laughs> okay, good. Uh, cloud? Maybe it's cloud today. It would have been really nice if I put in clove first, because I would have got the CLO. Although, honestly, clock would probably have been my next guest after... No, no, not necessarily. I think I might have thought about it, and I might have thought cloud for guest three. I should have went with clove first. That was my first thought. Cloud was a really good word. Cloud is a pretty popular wordle word, because it Test out some good letters there. Um, anyway, guys, uh, there is my Wordle solve. Let's go ahead and head on over to Connections. We'll see if I can do that one today. I think yesterday was... I think yesterday I had a tough time on all the games, if I remember right. Okay, here we go. Uh, connections, Monday, September 30th. Let's get started, see what words we have today. Today's words are Dorothy, Rome, Rose, Steam, Vanilla, Sophia, Shaggy. What are up with all these names? Sophia, Rose, well, I mean, Rose is not necessarily just a name, but Ambergris, Ambergris, what is this? Wallace is a name, Charlie's a name. Dorothy, okay. Interesting. Are these um, names of people on... What is that show called again? Sorry, guys. I'm having a rough day with my brain not working. I've had this on playing chess today, my video for today, and I've had this in recording the, the crossword. I've just felt like my brain is not working. Um, I Golden Girls. Oh, my gosh. Like, sorry. Um, is it... Okay. So, I'm thinking that these might be Golden Girls. I'm not sure exactly. Dorothy, Rose, probably Sophia. Oh, Blanche is one, right? I didn't even see that there at first. Yeah, I think these are names for the Golden Girls. I don't know. No. I think Rose, Dorothy, and Blanche for sure. Is it Sophia? I don't know. That's got to be a red herring, right? Like... I'm going to have to look up the Golden Girls after this just to check to see what their names are. Okay. Well, that sucks that it's not a category because I was really like, I was like unsure what to do with a lot of these words on here, these names and stuff. And I was like, oh, it's got to be Golden Girls. And it's not. So now what? Um, oh, uh, Steam Boil. Poach. Ways like to prepare food.
maybe Blanche is a word. I don't know what Blanche is, honestly. But I don't know. There's got to be a fourth word for, like, food stuff. So maybe it's Blanche. Maybe it's keto. Let's try Blanche. Yeah, that was right. All right, that was a guess. I, I did not know that. Um... So we got a bunch of names on here. I uh, I don't know what I'm going to do with the names. Rome. Rome is like a, a city as well. But that doesn't help. I don't think there's... I don't think there's going to be... Uh, see, my brain's not working, guys homophones see i yeah my brain is there's something something's wrong with my brain today i i need to like i need to like rest <laughs> I need to get a good meal in exercise a little bit get my brain functioning my brain function is not well today uh okay so a couple things here i have no idea what this word is there's a lot of names on here this one's gonna be i don't think i can solve this one at all today Shaggy, what what would that be? Shaggy makes me think of Scooby Doo, uh, so that that could be a name, but also just Shaggy is just a, a word. Um, vanilla, rose, things that smell good. I mean, musk is a word for like smells, right? Maybe not. I mean, if we're going with smells, maybe it's musk, and then maybe this is a smell as well. Like, I really don't know. Let's just try it and see if it's close. That's right. Common perfume ingredients. Okay, well, ingredients. Okay. I took a guess on the amber, I don't know if you, how you say that, ambergris, ambergris, ambergris? I don't know. All right. Keto. What is that? <laughs> like, what is... I mean, you have the keto diet, but, like, I don't... Also, we just have names. Sophia, Dorothy, Wallace, and Charlie are names. Let's put them in, see if it's right. It's not. It's one away. Ah. Okay. Wait, I said Rome is a city earlier, but Seoul is also a city. These are homophones for that. Keto, keto, keto. Maybe keto is one as well. I don't know. Um, and then what other one? Shaggy. Wallace. Charlie. Which one of these could be a city? See if it's one away. It is. Maybe Wallace? No. Okay, what what are the answers? Characters with pet dogs. Capital City homophones. Okay, so I there's no way I was getting that. Uh Charlie Charlie Brown? Dorothy, like from The Wizard of Oz, Shaggy, Scooby Doo, Wallace. Don't know Wallace. Um, and then Keto. Okay, I guessed right with, with Keto. I knew Rome, and I knew Seoul. Sophia? I don't know that one either. I'm pretty bad with geography overall. I'll definitely have to look those ones up later. Or you guys can tell me. Um, yeah, let's move on from this one. This one was a tough one. <laughs> this was a very tough one today for me. Uh, let me know if you guys got it, though. If you did, congratulations. I mean, I kind of guessed it right with this with that homophones. Getting two of them out of there, I mean, that was nice. I just couldn't finish it because there was no way I was getting the dog one at all. No way. <laughs> um, all right, time for the mini. Go ahead and move on here. Uh, today's a rough day for me just to use my brain for all these games. It's uh, I'm, I'm really just trying to get through these ones. I'm going to be honest with you guys. Just not a good day for me. Okay, here we go. Mini crossword. Uh, what jacuzzis, airports, and the NFL have in common? They all have jets. Nice. 
Film franchise features face huggers. Film franchise featuring face huggers. I don't think I did. I read that right the first time. Did I say featuring? Um, also, it all starts with F. Film franchise featuring face huggers. What does that mean? Face huggers? I don't. Well, it's a film franchise, so it's clearly something that I must not have ever watched. Use a loom. What's the word for this? I don't know if I can come up with that word. Threaded fastener. My brain is not working today. It gets kissed by the sun. No. I'm not playing this today, guys. I'm sorry. Film that was the highest grossing of all time before Star Wars was released. So to the J, film, highest grossing all time, Star Wars. So before Star Wars, great. This is before my time. Star Wars came out way before I was born. Um, So we're looking for a, a film now that's been out for a super long time. I have no idea. Movie knowledge is not great in, for me. Vote into office, elect... Headwear of a pageant, tiara. How do you say it? Tiara or is it tiara? Tiara. Number used to spell L on a calculator. Spell L on a calculator. What does that mean? Number used to spell L on a calculator. I don't know. I cannot comprehend what that is even. I My brain is not working. I cannot comprehend what that is even saying. I want the blank, not the weather. Film franchise, use a loom, weave, threaded fastener, screw, get kissed by the sun. I don't know. Jaws? Ah, Jaws. I don't know. Alien? Maybe I want the news, not the weather. What does that even mean? Seven? Oh, right. If you type in seven. Wait, hold on. Tans doesn't make sense because the, it, the you're adding an S. Gets. Oh, gets. I only read that as get kissed by the sun. Or maybe I maybe I read this as being got kissed. Whatever I interpreted that to be is I thought for sure this could not be tans because of the tense or the, the you know, how sometimes, you know. Yeah, I I, I misread that. Because crosswords, they, they're always, like, written in a way that you can guess the past tense, present tense, or, like, you know, whatever. Um, Okay. It said gets, so that was my mistake of not seeing that. I, my brain is just, I, I can't, I cannot play today. I'm, I'm, I mean, I clearly I'm good enough to be playing today, but my brain is, my brain feels like it's overheated right now. Uh, definitely, I, <laughs> uh, I, I'm surprised that I'm even able to, to play this, these today. Um, okay, here we go, strands. Um, I just, I just want to relax. I want to go take a nap right now. Like, I really just, I'm tired. Words with weight. Um, weight as in like, okay, so words with weight. So we're talking like grams and like ounces and like, no, I don't see ounce or even gram on here. Um, so words with weight. Okay, I guess I don't know. Stale. Okay, we can do this. We can do this. I'm like trying to I'm I'm literally trying to heavy. There we go. Light. I'm I'm trying to not just immediately just quit right now in the middle of the solves because I don't want to do this anymore. Um, this 
Is this boxing? Because I see feather on here. Yeah, boxing, right. He heavyweight, featherweight, lightweight. What are the other weights? I don't, I don't know that. Words with weight. Boxing. Lightweight, heavyweight, featherweight. Welter, isn't welter one? Welterweight, and then middleweight, I suppose. Got two left. I'm sure I've heard these last two before, but for some reason they're not coming to mind. Um, I, I don't want to do this. I, I just, I can't. I, 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 just give me the answers. I'm sorry. I'm just like, I'm... Slowly, I'm just, like, losing my mind right now. Nope, never heard of that one. I don't know. Bantam? No. Cruiser? Never heard of that. Okay. Well, sorry guys, I'm gonna get going. I apologize for like just constantly saying I'm not feeling good today and, and not really, uh, uh, you know, my, my, but like literally, guys, I'm, I'm just, I, I'm sorry. I just, I don't know. I just, I, I'm having a rough day today with everything and like recording these games is like the last thing I wanna do, but you know, I'm trying to stay consistent. So I'll try not to like, complain on days where I'm not feeling it like this but like I I can't help it today like just everything just feels overwhelming and I feel stressed out right now and I gotta go relax so I apologize for maybe ruining the vibe of the video I really don't want to do that but um it, this was a this was a struggle to get through today so hopefully tomorrow I'm feeling better this was just uh like my I feel pressure in my head right now like literally like like I just I cannot think and like, yeah, no, I can't think. <laughs> I cannot be thinking about stuff at the moment. All right, I'm going to get going. Sorry, I just, I mean, I, I don't know how many times I can apologize to you guys. I just, uh, the more I talk about it, the more upset. I'm getting upset just talking about this, like feeling the need to apologize. And I, I, I don't know. I just, I'm getting upset. So I'm going to end. I'm going to end the video. So sorry, guys. I'll see you tomorrow.